my channel I'm going to talk to you guys about being tall in Korea this is a question that I've been getting a lot on my channel and I did make a tall girl in Korea video about three and a half years ago I still live in Korea three and a half years later and I'm still tall so I decided to go ahead and make an update video about being tall in Korea especially since I have changed locations since my last video and a lot of you have been asking me to do an update video about being tall in Korea if you haven't seen my first video yet go ahead and check it out it is a little bit different than my style of videos now but go ahead and check that video out because some of the things I mentioned in this video are not necessarily the same as what I mentioned in my last video so honestly this video is going to be more so about little stories that I've experienced here in Korea as a tall girl and how things are different living here in Seoul versus when I used to live in Daegu or actually when I lived in Chilgok which is a very small little town right outside of Daegu. Daegu. <laughs> Okay, so let's go ahead and get started. So first off, I'm going to talk about the stairs. The stairs are the same here in Seoul. So if it's a younger person that's staring at me or looking at me, if I notice it, they'll usually look away. If it's an older person that's staring at me, they do not care, okay? They will look you up and down and try to figure out what you are. So that is kind of a slight difference between the ages, but overall, stairs are the same. I get stared at everywhere I go. Um, typically my friends notice it more than I do I think that's just because I've kind of put on these blinders to kind of block it out um, but yeah I definitely get stares a lot still people in Korea in general don't ask for pictures as much as in other countries but I do get people who want a picture with me every once in a blue moon I went to Daegu a few months ago and I got asked for a picture there and in Seoul I have yet to be asked for a picture so I don't know if it's a difference there at all I think Korea overall I haven't had as many people ask me for pictures as um, I have in other countries so between Seoul and Daegu I do feel that Seoul people are a little bit more outspoken here they're still not as outspoken as say America like when I go places in America somebody will just talk about my height very openly very directly to me but here it will be very indirectly or just kind of under their breath but um, definitely more so in Seoul than in Daegu so I have had moments or situations where I'll be shopping doing my thing and I would just hear someone be like whoa she's so tall in Korean obviously um, and I'll just because I understand Korean if I feel like it, I will kind of look over and smile or I'll just kind of ignore it and just act like I don't understand, which I guess is kind of like the benefit of being tall in a foreign country. You can kind of pretend like you didn't understand them. But yeah, so typically I might look over and just smile. Sometimes when I do that, they feel more comfortable to talk more about it. So then they'll ask me like, oh, more, more, or nonggu sangsu, nonggu sangsu, like, like stuff like that. And you know try to kind of spark a conversation or they'll ask me how tall I am or they'll guess how tall I am which leads me to the next thing the guessing game people will just randomly start spitting out numbers <laughs> I'll be again minding my business wait for the bus wait for the subway whatever the situation and they'll be like wow you meet her you meet her like so they're spitting out these numbers are saying like two meters two meters which to me sounds huge but I'm actually 10 centimeters away from being two two meters tall I don't know why I think six three sounds kind of like regular but two meters sounds like a giant for some reason I don't know that's just how I feel so most of the time people do guess or assume that I am two meters tall I am not two meters tall I'm 190 centimeters tall which is only 10 centimeters from two meters yeah I'm tall stuff like that happens very often and I feel like it is something that more like happens more here in Seoul versus in Daegu one thing that I noticed with older Korean women here in Korea there's something about like this motherly thing maybe I don't really know but something about the touchiness <laughs> of older Korean women here I honestly don't mind it and maybe it's because I have Korean aunts and like my mom's Korean I don't know but complete strangers okay I'll be walking down the street this one lady she just came up to me and she was like whoa and when she did that she grabbed my arm and was like rubbing on me and she's like whoa when I look at you I have to look like this 
I have to look like this. <laughs> it was so cute. I'm not even joking though. Like she, she was really adorable, but she was so animated, so surprised, so shocked at just how tall I was. And she was just grabbing me like, I mean, with force. It's kind of funny. It's kind of awkward, but it's also just funny. So another thing that I do get often are people who get startled by me. Um, I don't know if it's because I'm a little brown or if it's also like because I'm just tall. It could definitely be a combination of both. But I was coming out from the gym one day, and the way my gym is set up is kind of like in a in a in a not really an alleyway but kind of like a little corner so I have to like come out and then go onto the main sidewalk so I did that kind of suddenly in front of like a group of middle-aged women and when I did that the lady literally was like <gasps> like jumped or gasped and I kind of looked at her with a little bit of a side eye and a, and a slight smirk and after I did that or after she realized I'm not a threat I guess I don't know she looks at me and she grabs my arm I don't know what it is about this touchy-feely thing, but she grabs my arm and she goes, she looks up at me and she's like, Oh, you're so beautiful. You're so, so tall and beautiful. How tall are you? I don't know if it was a cover-up for her reaction, but I mean, at the end of the day, I respected it and I appreciated it. Like, appreciated the fact that she decided to be cool, calm, cool, and collected and, you know, kind of got to know me a little bit, I guess. So one of the big questions that I get a lot about being tall here in Korea is if Korean men like it? Have I dated Korean men? Do I date only tall Korean men if I have dated Korean men? Etc. 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 The, the list goes on. And just like I mentioned three and a half years ago, I have not dated a Korean man yet. Still to this day, I have not dated a Korean man. Um, I have gone out with a Korean man. I don't know if I want to consider it a date. I don't think so. I'm not going to consider it to consider it a date. But I did. I have gone out to dinner with a Korean man and he seemed very cool he didn't mind that i was taller than him he was real chill with that guy maybe because i am considered a friend he felt more comfortable i really can't answer that question that is like a, a number one almost a number one question that i get all the time i don't have an answer for you all i'm sorry i'm not going to just date a korean guy just to answer this question for you guys but i will go ahead and mention that dating shorter men i've only dated shorter americans have been pretty good and I don't know if it's just because of the men that I have happened to date now I think I do have a limit on how short they can be but I will talk about this in another video okay so another experience that I get here a lot which you know I do feel like this is a Korea thing I don't think I get this in America that often but here in Korea I do get people that will try to size me up like they'll stand next to me and they're like like measuring their head to like my shoulder or something and being like oh my god you're so tall Ooh, like i don't know being very animated about it i don't think i've ever experienced that in america now that i think about it but i i've gotten that here several times and sometimes people won't even do it like in front of me or like in a way that i notice it instead they'll do it kind of like behind me and like my friend will notice that they're doing it i guess it doesn't bother me but yeah something that i've noticed Okay, you guys, so that is all I have to say about being tall in Korea. This is just a quick update video because some of you have been asking about it. And since I am in a whole different city, I figured I'd go ahead and give you guys a little bit of an update. Um, hopefully it answers some of your questions. If not, go ahead and leave them below in the comment section and I will try my best to get back to you guys. Um, if, if not in the comments, then in another video. Okay, as always, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Take care and I will see you next time. Bye!